Hello. Last year, I was given the opportunity to do the Gregorian Chan Academy Masterclass for free so that I could do some reviews. So I have access to the main one, the master course. And at the time, the master course was the only one here. So if you click on courses, you get this video. If you click on unmute, we'll get to hear what he actually says. And he's, he's nice to listen to, so I totally recommend that. There are eight modules for the whole master course. History and Liturgy, which I have done. Square Notation, which I have almost also also done. Solemn Method, which I'm halfway through. So that's three. So there's five more modules. Semiology, Psalmody, which is, they've both been recorded, so they're ready. And Modality, which is being recorded each week. Um, the last two are Directing and Vocal Training, which will be in the fullness of time at the appropriate juncture when the moment is ripe. Final, live chant rehearsal via Zoom. Okay, master course only. So the master course is the one, the $500 one. Woohoo! And you can pay for it by the month there. Yep, okay. No, by the week. Yes, 12 weekly installments if one felt the straight up payment is too much. But it's still pretty... When you look at what you're getting, it is pretty good value. But, of course, having $500 on a course all at once is a bit much. So he has also put in mini courses. So now there are mini courses available. And the two modules that I've done have been combined into one mini course over the history and square notes. So it shows that the two course, the two modules that I'm proud to have done are the smallest ones in the whole course. But that's okay. They are also very interesting. They get you into knowing how to take the the written chant. Here we go. Here's some written chant on a mouse mat. There you go. And being able to decode that into pitches. So sound. And there's a little bit on, on the rhythm. But the rhythm is more in-depth in the Solemn method. This this one which is 15 lessons, five hours. So I'm not sure exactly how far through I am, but yeah, which um, explains some of this because there's different... In the history course, you remember the history course up the top? And you think, why do I have to do history? But yeah, you have to do history, sorry. Um, but it talks about a lot of French monks. Dom Macaro, Dom Cardin, Dom Gajard, Saunier... I can't remember all the names because I'm hopeless at French, full stop. But that makes sense once you get into the Salem method and you see the different interpretations of the chant from different points of view. So it does start to make more sense. So it is good to do the history. And it's not just videos too. At first I thought it was just videos, but there are exams, not exams, quizzes, assessments, assessments at the end of each module. So there was an assessment for the history one, which was a quiz, and the assessment for the square notes was a more written assignment, from what I remember. There might have been a quiz as well. Okay, I should have done more research, but it wasn't too hard. It wasn't wasn't too um, too stressful or anything. And yes, I have yet to get up to the rest of it. So that's that's where I'm up to. So I thought it was worth telling everybody the mini courses are now available and they are awesome. So a little pick up. A few people have asked me if I could describe the different tones, the different um, psalm tones for all the ch eight church modes. And I have I have started, I think I did modes two and four, and then I forgot. I mean, yeah, I haven't got around to it yet. But if you would like a much more thorough version, this one over here, the psalmody course, goes through all the different tones. And um, the teacher is much more um, versed, well versed in Gregorian chant than I am. And so, if you want a basic overview of church modes, take the Psalmody course. It is available now. Just double check that it's available now. Psalmody, Psalmody, and Hymnody. Cool. Okay. So it's thirty-three lessons for a hundred dollars, and that will answer all the questions on all the different church modes and more. The platform they're using is, it was going to be a temporary platform called Volley. So I'm, I'm using tabs here. And this is what the master course looks like on Volley. And you can see there's a big spare space in the middle. But I don't want to show you the master course. Yeah, I can't just play the, the whole thing for you. Hang on. If I move my head out of the way, because I am in the way a little bit here. Okay. Now, um, there are lots of modules, and you can see there's a number for each of the modules. So there we go. History is the first one, and square notes and slam method. So they may not be in order, but that's... I think the last one to be updated will be the top of the list. So the last one to have things... Yes. 
Semiology was the last one to have extra videos or extra material added to it. And so that, that carries that to the top. And as you can see, even though the semiology one was completed, it has been added to as questions arise where there's some clarification required. So sign up now and it'll be worth even more by the time you finish it. There'll be even more there than there is already. So let's see. Do you want to see? I guess if I show you the Salem method one, that might be the best way. This is the web interface. There are also apps. There's an app for the Android and app for iPhone. And there are also desktop apps for Windows and Mac and even for Linux. The Linux one I actually asked, I mentioned it in the help. When you sign up, you get this um, direct messages thing. And Hello Volley has different suggestions on how you can use Volley. So it, it helps you with just the technicalities of using the platform. And you can ask him, that guy there, about the Linux thing and um, yeah, and he'll connect you with a guy who can give you the um, the repo for the Ubuntu um, parcel for installing Volley on your Linux computer, which I'm not actually using. I'm not using the app at the moment because it's it's pretty much the same as the web thing, the web interface. Yes. So, so you can see each one, the, it's packaged in short videos. And um, it's they can have um, links to other resources. I can't see any links here, but yeah. It, if you've ever used Snapchat, it reminds me of Snapchat in that a lot of it is communicating via videos and pictures, but you can also, like in Snapchat, use text as well. So um, yeah, don't don't be um, shy if you hate having your photo on the yeah if you ha hate having your photo taken you don't have to use the video function if you don't want to but it is very friendly to see all the other people who are doing the doing the course so um anything else each video is only about 20 minutes long i think that's an actual um limitation in the volley um volley platform so you do see some videos where he runs out of time and then you say sorry i ran out of time and start the next video um yes Anyway, it's, it's very good information. You can see he's explaining on the whiteboard and you can see he's working out how best to explain things. So, um, yeah, he's working at a fairly high level. So I haven't talked to... I, I know other people who are not as experienced in chant as I am who are doing the course who have still found it very helpful and they're still plugging away at it. Um, yeah, I guess it's one of those things. You just take in what you can understand. You can always come back to it and understand it a bit more when things make more sense. So so that is what is available, what you get when you sign up for these things. Yes. Um, I, I remember at the beginning there was plans to move on to a specifically coursey sort of platform, which would be um, even easier to use. But, yeah, so far it's still on volley. That is still, still pretty good. Okay. Another thing I found with this website, let's see, we should probably look at the music tab. No, there's a music tab. If you're following Christopher Jasper on YouTube, you will find he does some beautiful recordings and these are available so you can buy the MP3s here. He also, what is that? Also has a give button so you can, can you see the give? There's the give button up there. Yep. You can pay through PayPal or through a website called buymeacoffee.com where you can either donate a one-off thing or um, sign up for regular donations, a membership. So he also has a wish list. This is a new feature of Buy Me A Coffee and he's got custom acoustic panels. So if you want to help him buy custom acoustic panels, you can chip in there. Um, let's see, but back to the web page. I found down the bottom... It's not very obvious. There's a store button. And if you want some merchandise, if you've admired the black hoodie that he wears in all the videos, here it is. So it's a Gregorian Chan Academy hoodie. And on the back it says, I thought it said keep warm and chant on, but it's keep calm and chant on. So yes, I think you might have to get this hoodie. And it is available all over the place. All of them are available. There's, there's one product i think it's the black the black mug with the gregorian in hand is only available in the u.s so if you're in the u.s you have to get it because no one else can but anyway yes you have a gregorian chant mug a sing wisely mug and a mouse mat and i'm pretty sure he's using the same company i've been using for my merchandise so it's it'll be um pretty good quality and um 
yeah, they're printed in different places around the world. The mouse mat, I think, came from the US, but the mugs are fulfilled locally. That's why I'm not sure. But yeah, I ha I wasn't, um, when I was setting mine up, I didn't have the option for a black mug. So the black mugs must be just in the US, but the white mugs can be printed all in different places around the world. And um, so the postage should be reasonable. Okay, but that's enough of how to buy stuff from the Gregorian Chan Academy. But yeah, it's it's worthwhile supporting them. Um, yeah, they have, there's a small family still, still growing. They have a new baby girl due in June, I think. Soon, anyway, yes, so it's all exciting. You, you get updates about their family and, and all things that so are thank happening. You. Thank you, thank you very kindly for situation. listening through my review of the Gregorian Head Academy offerings in music courses and donations and merchandise even. And I hope you find something and some way to give back to this um, amazing family who has been giving so much to help keep chant going. Yes, because it's not... Don't just leave it to the musicians. Even if you're not a musician, you can still sign up and learn something from this course and keep these guys going. So God bless, and I'll see you next video.